when it talks about, you know, giving money in the Old Testament and even in the New Testament, it's talking about giving money not even to God, but to the poor, to the widows, to the strangers, to the, to the orphans, to the, you know, you know, to people who are disenfranchised in the society. Most giving of money that is being talked about in the New Testament and the Old Testament is not about giving to God. It's about giving to people, to help people. I was naked, you didn't feed me. I mean, you didn't clothe me. I was uh, hungry, you didn't feed me. I was, uh, you know, I was in hospital. You didn't. This is the kind of giving that when it's, it's about giving to people because you cannot give God money. It's giving to people. When he's talking about money, he's giving it to people, taking care of people, people who are less privileged, people who have needs. They're giving arms. That is what God is talking about when he's talking about money. So when we, if we really want to talk about giving money, let's give it to people. Let's give it to people, not, not to church, not to God, not to create in people the impression that they can give money to God and get satisfied and just give by giving money to God and they can just, you know, you know, cool God off. I say, oh, I've given, I mean, I've given my own share. I've given, you know, that's what most people, that's the attitude that most people have today. They just say, oh, but I give my offering. I give my tithe and offer. So they just like, they are giving, they, they are paying off God. They are bribing God with their money. They are trying to pay God off. They are trying to, you know, we trivialize God. We trivialize God. And it's a shame. We trivialize God. Just because we think that we can buy God off. We can pay God off. It's a payoff.